Epiretinal membrane is basically a age-related um, growth of an epiretinal membrane, a fine membrane over the macular surface. Causes distortion in vision. Uh, it's not a particularly aggressive disease um, like retinal detachment. Uh, there's not a risk of going blind, but it does uh, decrease the quality of vision and can impair uh, reading vision and such. It's a kind of an uncommon problem you know, in the general population. Because it's not something that's blinding like a detached retina and such, it's not something you necessarily have to um, you know, uh, run around and be worried about. Oftentimes, uh, the other eye compensates because uh, it can develop slowly. Sometimes it's associated with a process called vitreous detachment where there are acute flashing and floaters, uh, which are a normal uh, aging process, and then the uh, epiretinal membrane develops after that. So sometimes uh, people are brought, you know, to pay attention to it and, and do notice it, especially if it's your dominant eye. You live with it and the slight impairment of vision or you have surgery to fix it. And our criteria usually is uh, if you don't see well enough to pass a driving test, that would be something that we would consider surgery for. Surgery is, is relatively, you know, it's a relatively straightforward uh, procedure. It takes about 30 minutes to do. Uh, most people do fine with the surgery. Uh, 80 to 90 percent of people will see better after uh, surgery. The main downside of epiretinal membrane surgery is that if you haven't had cataract surgery, it will accelerate uh, cataract development and about half the people will need cataract surgery within a couple of years. Cataract surgery is very safe these days and so it's not an issue. If somebody comes in and has a cataract already, frequently I'll have them go and see about having the cataract removed first and sometimes that results in improvement in vision enough that um, they don't need to have the epiretinal membrane surgery. If it impairs your vision, then you should have it done and you shouldn't be afraid to have it done.